That weird, like, noise, that's a part of the game. That's kind of throwing me off. Uh, do game select. Oh, that's so I can leave this and, okay. Uh, language setting. Subtitles by, can be toggled on and off during cutscenes by pressing the select button. Alright, that's neat. Transferring. What is this? Again, I forget. Oh, it's from... okay. It's for a PSP. PlayStation Portable. <laughs> Alright, let's just get, get into it then. New game. Input your player name. Oh, that's easy. Then... Oh, I have to, I have to go... Oh god, I hate this. Uh... Oh god, now I have to go all the way around, fuck. Uh... It was like the first letter, I don't know why that was hard for me to... I, I, you know, I was gonna just put G-Wiz, but now I gotta commit to the full thing. Uh... Yeah, this isn't so bad anymore. Bam. Um, bam. Oh shit, it's not- fuck. So I'll go back. There we go. And I hate the old PS3 system. It's like old phone... input. <laughs> I have not used it in like centuries. Centuries. <laughs> Alright. Yes, that is fine. I like that text. I should use that. Uh... Shooter type. The configuration is similar to that of MGS4. The configure the action type is what is it? Oh, that's portable ops. Hunter type. The configuration is similar to that of Monster Hunter Monster Hunter Freedom. Uh, I think I'm gonna use shooter type, and then leave everything else the same. Hit X, yeah. Very strange. This is a PlayStation Portable game. <clears throat> that nice yellow. The year was 1964. The world was firmly held in the grip of the Cold War divided into East and West. One of America's heroes had defected to the Soviet Union. Dun dun dun! She was known as the Boss, the mother of all special forces, and the soldier said to have led the Allies to victory in World War II. However, the American-made miniature nuclear warhead she took with her was used to destroy a Soviet research facility. Facing full-scale nuclear war, the leaders of the world's superpowers held top-secret talks to avert um, get The Soviet Union wanted assurance that this was not the work of Uncle Sam. They wanted America to eliminate one of the most legendary soldiers, the boss. And that they did. The person assigned to this mission was their closest apprentice, the soldier known as Snake. Snake made the anguished journey into enemy territory, eventually confronting and killing the boss at a fortress called Gronzegrad. Uh, Groznegrad. Proving America's innocence, blah blah blah. Having saved the hero, Snake was hailed as the true hero and given the title Big Boss. Big Boss! Uh. Following the award ceremony, however, Snake disappeared. This is where he was. <laughs> and this is his story. Oh snap. The Hideo Kojima game. Robin Atkin Downs, Terror Strong. Christopher Randolph. Gray Delisle. Oh, Robin, Robin Atkin Downs is a Kaz, isn't he? Military San Frontier, Soldiers Without Borders. I know that because of Doctors Without Borders.
<laughs> okay. Steve Blum. I think I heard uh, Yuri Lowenthal's like voice. Oh man, he's about to just start wrecking people. <laughs> David Hater. <laughs> no inviting me for co-op, 0 out of 10. I forgot that was even a thing. Hey, boss! Wanna go around? Free control time, start button end. Was, oh god. Eh! Eh! <laughs> Show him how it's done, boss! Jesus, this guy is so your loud, he's screaming. Territory is knowing your surroundings. Your life depends on where you are looking and how fast you can your target. Therefore, I need to turn this shit down. It doesn't come in until like after the tutorial. Use the right okay. Stick. Now when I give you an order, look in that direction. That's your Lowenthal, by the way. <laughs> look up! Good! Look down! Good! You should be familiar with the up and down controls now. Press the action button if you're ready to move on. Okay. <laughs> Next, we'll check your left and right. Pretty sure that's your Look right. Good. Look left. Oh, I don't like Good. this. This is inverted you be as fuck. With the left and right controls now. Press the action button if you're ready to move on. <laughs> yeah, he's fucking screaming. Can I, like, change this at any point? I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Alright, let's try left and right on the right stick one more time! <laughs> Next, we'll summon right. our persona. Good! Look left! Good. Okay, he changed it. You should be familiar with the left and right controls now. Press the action button if you're ready to move on. Why would, why would they do both? Okay! You can change the controls anytime in options. Okay. Go with the method that works best for you. Next, I'll explain how to change stances. If you just stand there like an idiot in front of an enemy, you might as well kill yourself now. <laughs> At times, you will need to get low to avoid detection. You have three stances. Oh, uh, okay. Crouch and lying down. I thought there was like a change stance system, not the just crouch <laughs> crouch and everything. Tap the crouch button to change between standing and crouching. You can move in either stance. Hold the crouch button and keep it held to lie down. However, you cannot move while you are lying down. Dude, I'll this see that is again. the best. You cannot move while lying down. Is that clear? Oh, so you can't move while lying down. I, I fucking, like, completely omitted that. Good. Next, we'll work on your movement. Use the left stick to move around. Tilt it a little to walk slowly, tilt farther to run. Decide which to use based on your situation. Remember I'm on it. that your footsteps are louder when running, making you easier to discover. Be careful! Dun 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 <laughs> Good! Now we have rolling. Rolling is useful for knocking down enemies in your way, and for getting away when surrounded. You can also use it to jump over small ditches and other obstacles. To roll, tap the crouch button while running. You got that? Tap the crouch button while running. Don't forget it. <laughs> I'm on it. Do I have to roll in like every direction? Yeah. Next, I will explain how to attack without gunfire. You may run into an enemy unexpectedly. You may not have a weapon on you, or you may be out of ammo. You'll still need an effective attack strategy. One well-placed strike and the enemy won't know what hit him. To strike an enemy, press the attack button while standing still. On my command, press the attack button repeatedly and take down your opponent. As his voice is Go. the medic in TF2. I'm ready, boss. It seems like a weird roll. <laughs> oh, it wasn't his command. Impressive, boss! Next, we're gonna practice oh, using the stun rod. It didn't matter. Hitting someone with the stun rod will shock them with a million and a half volts. 
Anyone on the receiving end of that is guaranteed to be out cold. To use the stun rod, press the aim button to ready it, then press the attack button. You'll be glad to know I'm we're using it. mock stun rods for this training session. When your partner attacks, make him believe it's the real deal. Prepare yourself for stun rod training. Go! I just realized there's like weird black boss. borders. Huh. Let me, let me fix this. this. Now we'll what? move on to CQC. CQC, or close quarters combat, refers to when engaging an enemy in battle at very close range. Is? It no, is a quick and good. efficient way of eliminating the Oh, you the know threat. what it is? I there think it's because of, uh, CQC techniques. We will it's go the over way that I, uh, I adjusted Don't get the screen. because you think you know them. This will be different from what you're used to. Pretend you so are learning it for the first the time. The first technique is I can probably opponent. do that in options, so I'm not really this, too worried. Position yourself near your opponent and press the attack button while you tilt the left stick. Be sure to press the attack button when the icon appears. Now, wait for my command and throw I your kinda opponent. wasn't paying attention, so Go. I'm just gonna I'm ready, boss. Gonna roll with it. <laughs> okay, I did it. Impressive, boss! Next, I'm going to teach you how to restrain an opponent close to you. This is a cornerstone of CQC. Grab hold of an enemy, and the bastard's life is in your hands. <laughs> what you do from there is up to you. I snap his neck, always. Just know that if you restrain him for too long, the average person will most likely pass out. Something to Good. keep in mind. Let's begin. And then I to snap their necks. Opponent, hold down the attack button while near them. Restrain your opponent on my command! I actually like how they give a t fucking tutorial in this I'm game, a tutorial proper. Fine Start work, talking. boss! Start talking. <laughs> now we will Start throw talking. your opponent after restraining them. To throw an enemy to the ground, press a direction on the left stick when you have them restrained. Restrain your opponent and throw them on my command. Go! I'm ready, boss. I guess I can just do it whenever anyway. Impressive, boss! Now we will try <laughs> CQC against multiple enemy opponents. You can also take out a group of enemies by throwing an opponent you have restrained. First restrain an opponent by pressing the attack button near them. Then tilt the left stick to throw them. By tilting the left stick toward other enemies, you can send your captive flying straight into them. On my oh, command, snap. restrain and then throw your opponent. Go! I'm ready, boss. <laughs> Ugh. Wait, what was that other thing? There was like another prompt that I could press. Is there like a timing thing there? I'm not really sure what that is. I just pressed R1. Why don't we do something special since the boss is here? Anyone who feels like getting their ass kicked, step forward. Don't hold back, boss. When you're I'll kick their asses. Enemies, you'll have to take them on one after the other. To do it, simply press the attack button again while throwing the current enemy. Oh, just that's what sure that is. Wait for the icon to appear. Okay. Go. I'm ready, boss. Fucking do this. Ugh. Boss, Holy shit. The attack button when the icon appears. Okay. Boss, press the attack button when the icon appears. I pressed it. Am I Boss, supposed to time it up? I think I am supposed appears. to time it. Press the attack button when the icon appears. Left stick. Oh, am I supposed Boss, to? Press the attack button when the icon appears. Left stick I'll and action button when the enemy is near. Oh, and then. Okay, enemies, he wants me to. Have to take them on one after the other. To do it, simply press the attack button again. So he I'll wants me to chain each enemy. and every one. Just be sure to wait for the icon okay. to appear. I see now. I'm 
There we go. All right. Wow, CQC is like super fluid. Go. I'm ready, boss. All right. So it wasn't a timing thing. It's just the, okay. Fantastic. And stop. That's it for today. Yeah. Thank you, boss. Still got a lot to learn, rookies. You're not, you're not that good at pressing R1. That face. Oh, snap. Snake, David Hader. What's going on, Kaz? Oh my god, it's like a comic? We've got guests. Time to move. Don't worry, it's not our friends from Langley. Kazuhira Miller. I brought him. Made sure we won't fall. Thank you, big boss. Call me Snake. Oh, uh, sorry, Vic Boss. Vic Boss. For us, there is no victory. But in revolution, doesn't one triumph or die? We don't do either. We don't triumph or die. Something a muerte. I had no idea that like cutscenes were comic books. Who is this man? I feel like a new man. That's Steve Blum. Like Costa Rican coffee. That's who that is. <laughs> so, what brings a distinguished scholar from the Costa Rican government to Colombia? Professor Galvez comes from Costa Rica's University for Peace. Galvez. Steve Blum. You see, over the past year, there have been sightings of an armed group in Costa Rica. They're not ours, of course. Good old Steve. Costa Rica doesn't have an army. Correct. Article 12 of our constitution states that the army as a permanent institution is abolished. The peace constitution. You think it's rebels who fled Nicaragua? No, no, they don't appear to be guerrillas. They're far too organized. What's your government's take? <laughs> the authorities in San Jose are a multinational security firm hired by the Development Corporation of Costa Rica. Lies, obviously. They're bringing in state of the art. I feel like I don't need to put these up, but I'm going to for future Where future cutscenes that maybe person? don't have this. I fear La Cia may be involved. The CIA. As you both know, the United States views Central America as its backyard. Even after Cuba, we've managed to maintain a delicate balance with the U.S. And your government can't just give them the boot. We are not allowed to bear arms. Not allowed to bear arms, hmm? Japan's constitution has something similar. Article 9. It says Japan renounces war and can't maintain an army. I understand that you and your men have neither state nor ideology. That you <laughs> he really the can't like that. Please, you must drive them out of our defenseless country. But basically, we're mercenaries. The militaire sans frontières. Flawless so, pronunciation by Steve Durham. Yes, as our deterrent. We can't afford to pay much, it's true. But we can offer you this. A forward operating base. An offshore plant in the Caribbean. Sounds pretty good to me. This place is becoming a mess anyway. Snake, we need someplace we can settle down. The governments agreed to cooperate. Unofficially, of course. 
A chopper for mm -hmm. transport would be nice too. I'll see what I can do. Hold it. You seem to think we're just a pack of dogs of war. Is that right? Yes. Like mercenaries. You're an army without a state. No. We've only left our countries behind. Please, you must help us. If your suspicions are true, force isn't going to do any good. You'll have to find a political solution. The government's hands are tied. Go back to your bosses in San Jose. Tell them if they want, I'll introduce them to a negotiator I know. No. I'm not here on their behalf. So, what are you doing here? For over 20 years, I've preached the virtues of peace at multiple universities. Tonight, I stand before you as an educator. This is my student. She came to me to study peace. Her name is Paz. Paz Ortega. Paz Ortega. Paz. Peace. No kidding. That's my name too. Kazuhira. It's Japanese. Oh, isn't that just fucking convenient? Pleased to meet you, Paz. Call me... Kaz. Aha. Uh -huh. They've got a supply Damn. port Rejected. in Puerto Limon, a town in La Costa del Mar Caribe. A few days ago, Paz stumbled upon that facility while searching for a lost friend. She was captured. She's only a child. Sixteen years old. Sixteen years old. Terrible things to her. But somehow she managed to escape. What, what, what is the... Oh. My God. What is this, what is this for? Her. her mother died when she was small. And she lost her grandparents. He's Huerfana? She hates war with a passion like her mother. Oh, I can... Oh, jeez. <laughs> my name is Paz. And I will do anything to protect my namesake. It is my one and only purpose. Please, get them out of my country. Make them leave Costa Rica. Sorry, kid. We know who you are, big boss. That is why we've come to you. <laughs> I was like, I was pretty sure everybody knew who Big Boss was at this point. At least a lot of people. Unless he's not like an icon. Yet. That's his voice kind of shit. That's not true. It's fucking... It's just Tara Strong doing like a Spanish accent. I mean, I guess. I, well, Steve Blum's not doing an accent. This is weird. This HUD's weird. Oh god. Oh, this is weird. Keep your headphones on at all times and pay attention. Also, make sure no one else can listen in. Snake, are you clear on the controls? Take a minute to refresh your memory. Use the left stick to move. Use the right stick to adjust your view. Oh, this is weird. Does this thing have batteries? To change your settings, use the start button. To I don't think so. <laughs> Try some shooting practice. Select a target and squeeze off a round or two. Press the oh, directional geez. buttons while holding the R2 button to switch weapons. Ready your weapon. Oh my god, what the button. fuck? Then press the R1 button to fire. How about a little oh, shooting can... practice? Try hitting a coconut. Try hitting a coconut, eh? Select equipment by pressing the square or circle button while holding the L2 button. To check your map, press the start button. Or I could not do that and just use the stick. The M16 is a standard assault rifle, capable of rapid fire. What? <laughs> the over the shoulder view allows you to aim with a high degree of precision. Yeah, I prefer this. Will automatically shift your aim to hit nearby body parts. If you want to change the aim settings, take a look under options. 
hitting an enemy's vital points can bring them down this is fine this is doesn't seem bad say if you just want to slow the target down shoot him in the legs the mark 22 tranquilizer gun can put enemies to sleep the closer to the head you hit the more effective it is oh yeah I can't crawl don't waste them Controls your ass. Uh, I can, uh. I don't need to switch my controls. I already set it to MGS4 controls, so. Uh, what I can do is, I think, change the, uh. Or not. I can't change the, uh. What is it? The fucking. Like the. The, the borders on the. Yeah, the controls are already changed to this. This is fine. Um. Yeah, I'll have to do it in OBS then. <gasps> uh, let me do that real, real fast. Take it like a second. Find the right. Uh, that oh, like borders. Actually, hopefully that doesn't cut anything off. It doesn't look like it does. Yeah, I think that's fine. All right. Did he tell me where to go? I guess the I just leave. Oh, okay. That a grenade should be able to take out that gate. Uh -oh. explode. You throw them, snake. Use the L1 button to ready throwing weapons. Once you've ready the weapon, throw with the R1 button. I know how to play the game. Hold the attack button down longer. Oh, okay. I didn't actually know that. But now I do. <laughs> I gotta thank you for agreeing to this snake. Man, am I glad to be out of here. Finally, we can leave all that crap in San Geronimo behind. Break into the mercenary business for real. Let me guess. You're doing it for her, aren't you? I don't know, I'm gonna kill everybody. Uh, literally no fucks given. <laughs> I mean, if, when I, if I want to stealth, then yeah. But if, if, I, if I'm gonna shoot people, I'm gonna kill everybody. Still I guess here. this is an MGS4 though, so I guess I'm not gonna have to shoot people as often. They're willing to give us an offshore plant, a place we can finally put down some roots. This is our chance to expand MSF. We don't need a place to stay, guys. We're nomads. We always will be. What? You'd rather keep wandering from conflict to conflict? Tools in the hands of whoever's fighting at the time? The second we settle down, who's to say we won't become the warmongers? Listen to me, Snake. We're not mercenaries. We're not a foreign legion. MSF's a business. A new kind of business. I'm not even really sure what that even means, like... Look, it's not like we're trying it seems to like they're, they're pretty, All we need pretty to much mercenaries who have, are very selective. Really is. Come on, Kaz. It's pretty obvious that they're backed by the CIA. Wait a sec. That would mean... Our friend, the professor, is likely KGB. I see. We'd be making an enemy of our homeland. And there'd mm. be no turning back. Ah, this damn thing won't light. <laughs> Put on some cover. We'll have some trouble there. It's time for a little chat with the professor. What? <laughs> I was a heavy smoker. <laughs> when I got my medal from the Secretary General, he gave me this prosthetic hand as well. But smoking was ruining my lungs, so I quit. 
I've not had much use for it since. It even says CCCP. It's quite an honor to meet the legendary Big Boss. That's just a code name the CIA made up. Maybe all the cutscenes are like this then. John. <laughs> I don't have a name. Stop using that code name you liked so much ten years ago. What about you, comrade? What do they call you back at center? Well then, allow me to get straight to the point. Land as slim as a whip, hot as torture. That's the Chilean poet, Neruda. The Chilean poet Neruda. The American continent north and south. We want this land. We'll build a socialist stronghold, then use it to split the Americas in two. America would lose its backyard. And with it, its economic production, shipping lanes, and strategic value. We, on the other hand, would gain a base from which all of Latin America would be well within our reach. He who controls Central America will win this Cold War. First comes Nicaragua, toppling the pro-American Somoza regime. In preparation, we've begun instigating anti-Somoza sentiment and providing aid to the Sandinista National Liberation Front. Sandinista National You're Liberation Front. you Sandinista into overthrowing Somoza for you. After the revolution, Nicaragua will become a socialist state. You think America's just gonna let that happen? Certainly not. After all, the CIA is already here. And that's the armed group inside Costa Rica. Precisely. It's clear that they've been sent in to disrupt our efforts across the border in Nicaragua. Simply put, the army now stationed in Costa Rica is CIA capital. But it's more complex than that. The CIA's got something else planned as well. What? That is the million dollar question. Big boss, we what want the CIA to, have planned? to find the answer. Infiltrate and investigate the facility in La Costa where Paz was imprisoned. Learn all you can of their operations. Then, drive them out of the country. Huh. You're asking us to settle a turf war between the KGB and the CIA? What about her? That was all just an act? Hmm. You mean her words about peace? She was captured, that much is true. But I've kept my KGB affiliation from her. And you thought we'd fall for a sob story? No. I had good reason to bring her along. She managed to escape with her life, but her friend was not so lucky. That's pretty rough. Why were they attacked? I believe this will help explain. Perhaps they saw something the tape. they weren't supposed to. Perhaps they heard something they shouldn't have. A Tony. <laughs> Postures uh. during her escape. She says her friend happened to record it by accident. What is that? It's a Sony cassette player. It's a Walkman. <laughs> first of its kind. The first Walkman. I heard they were working on something like that in Japan. Didn't know you guys were too. I believe what you're about to hear will help you understand. Pretty sure that's straight out of Japan. What is that? A quetzal? The phoenix bird. Pass's friend was researching birds. She went out into the jungle to record bird calls and stumbled upon this. So? So what? There's a horse. Now it gets interesting. I need to get rid of it. I chase it back to its nest. 
You can't. The snake's too vicious. It's all... Many people... I chase it away. It will bite you unless you kill it. Go home. Awesome. Voice print analysis confirms that this voice is indeed that of the legendary Wait, hero what? <laughs> and criminal, the boss. Wh what? The other hasn't been identified. Female in her 30s with a British accent. The song playing in the background was a hit in 1973. I didn't even hear the song. I feel like I should turn this up, but like... Loyalty to your country. I don't want somebody to scream again. Your country or your mentor. Your mission. There it is. I am loyal to myself. Oz is alive in Costa Rica. As I understand it, she was your commander, fought by your side. And that you killed her under orders from the CIA. Thus surpassed her to become the hero known as Big Boss. Oh my god, this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> like, I can't turn it up because shit like that's gonna happen. But I can't hear it, so I have to read the subtitles. But there's no subtitles for music. What would it be? Will you take the job? Snake. Look at that shitty grin. So you still can't turn your back on your country. Then I suppose you won't need this. What? <laughs> Wait. Snake. Flit. Peace then. For peace. Bosque de Alba, Bell Alba. There they are, CIA Mercs. Snake, you've got to get past them undetected. Avoid combat whenever possible. I'm on it. Yeah. This is a sneaking mission. Hide behind stuff. Take the long way around. Whatever it takes what? to stay out of sight. Oh, God like... The last resort. It could just as easily kill you as save you. Is this, isn't this suppressed, though? Why don't I just... Oh, that was weird. To press up against a wall, face it and hit the action button. From that position, you can press the L1 oh. button to detect enemies. That I can't drag him? Down. Do I not need this? Oh, there we go. We'll keep it here at the base. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. He also just told me something that I wasn't exactly listening to. The indicator in the upper right serves as a compass and shows sound sources. Pay attention to your surroundings. Sound source is coming from everywhere. Keep your hey. what's left of your life gauge on the left of the screen. To the right of that, you'll see your sight gauge. It oh, that's like awful. <laughs> I feel like they could have uh, maybe redone that. Recover faster crouching than standing up. Lying flat works even better. Can I not? Oh, that's auto aim. Can I not zoom in? I have to just like take the shot. I did it. <laughs> Maybe if I was closer, it would have auto locked on. Yeah, okay, what do you got? I feel like if I do it too many times, he'll just like wake up. Very approaching. Um, I feel like I might as well take this guy out. Got him. The percentage in the upper right is your camo index. The lower the number, the more easily you'll be Ration. Conspicuous movements. You're ready to eat. Select from equipment window and press triangle index. to use. Your fatigues will act as camouflage. I'm gonna do two. When you to be safe. The jungle, you'll be there. Head east. All right. Oh shit. Did that guy wake up? 
I, I probably could have just snuck behind him, but... I don't know if this guy woke up or he walked over here. Yeah, I think he woke up. <clears throat> That is very strange. <laughs> okay. Looks like you're inside the comp. Security is tight. Stay sharp. There's that guy up there. Not a fan of that. I not make too much noise when I'm doing this. Oh shit. Um. Not really a fan of this situation. I'm gonna get like down. Shit. I don't think I can aim while I'm down either, can I? Okay, so you can do that. That's a shot and a half. All right, I'll just go now. Love box. What are you gonna use that for? Would well, shut up, cause how about that? Dun 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 dun. As long as I take this guy out. <laughs> Got him. We're good. And I can just... That's a shot and a half. <laughs> uh, that's a shot and a half. Can I not, like, sneak through this back gate? No, it doesn't look like it. How do I take this shot? Uh... Where is he? Did he go around by that? No, there he is, there he is. I want to be pretty careful. <clears throat> oh shit. This is not a great idea. Okay, here we go, here we go. Bam. Got him. Infiltrate the facility on the east side of the compound. Alright. Opening slash investigate the supply facility complete. <clears throat> yes, sir, we broke him. We acquired the whereabouts of target five zero zero. Acknowledged. Damn. Spears are loaded. The barge is cleared, Point Bravo. Acknowledged. Al. <laughs> Oh, R1? Oh, I didn't... I didn't realize... Oh, shit. I didn't realize we were going to be quick time events. The cargo. Where's it headed? What is it? Irisu. In the mountains. What's up there? What? Oh, my God. Oh my god, get stun rotted, dude. The hell was that? Hell is going on. What are those? Oh, those are like IDs, I guess. That looks like a drone. Is it playing music? Hmm. Guest artist Ashley Wood. This is Snake. Kaz, can you hear me? Loud and clear. You found a radio. It's got a circuit that reverses the audio phase. Let's switch oh. frequencies from time it's to time. It's supposed to be Olga. To make sure we're not detected. 
I'd found a map of their bases. The cargo Wait, no. marshes west towards Irasu. Not Those are different boss. people. It looked like Cause almost no, wait, it kinda looked like the end. I think that's what I'm thinking of. Like but like with a hat on. Yeah, the radio man was wearing one. And whoever he was talking to called the cargo spears. Wait, that would mean Nukes. They're bringing nukes into Costa Rica. Holy mother of God. <laughs> Holy mother of God. Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. An army without borders. Let's see an interaction. Oh, and I got 9 out of 10 because I wasn't paying attention. Uh, obtain design specs for the flying weapon slash item. Okay. Okay. That has little meaning to me. Think you can use it? It tells me where their bases are, but it's just a bunch of points. No routes. I need better intel on the lay of the land. Snake, the professor said he's got the Sandinistas on his side. Said you should get in touch with the FSLN Commandante. Hmm. Do they know they're backed by the KGB? Nah. As far as they know, they're really fighting for the revolution. The KGB is staying behind the scenes. I'm not sure the Sandinistas are aware of what's really going on. Still can't believe anybody would bring nukes here. Yeah, that's a shocker. Costa Rica's party to the Plata Loco Treaty, which declares Latin America a nuke-free zone. Based on Japan's three non-nuclear principles, it bans the testing, use, import, or deployment of nuclear weapons. If word of this gets out, Opinol will be forced to act. It'll cause an international uproar. The treaty was signed to prevent another Cuban Missile Crisis. Opinol? The U.S. itself is gonna scrap it. Latin America is too close to spawning another Cuba or two already. The entire continent would become one big powder keg. Well, if they did bring nukes, we can't let them get away with it. Are they planning a test? Showing off? Or is it all to keep the anti-American movement in check? Good question. Why bring them here? I can't figure it out. Whatever the CIA's up to in Costa Rica, the professor wants it stopped. The professor wants it stopped. Is. We need to get ready first, Kaz. Repairs? Working as fast as we can, boss. This place is pretty beat. It looks like hell. But as long as you're with us, we'll make it heaven. No one can bother us here. No state telling us what to do. Hmm. This is the MSF's haven, our mother base. And with this mother home, base. We'll back you up even better than before. We're gonna turn this pile of junk into something big. I didn't change my name at all. I didn't make a new PSN either. I just the the name of the profile is different. Welcome to MSF's Mother Base. Mother Base can support your mission in many different ways from developing new weapons, collecting intelligence. Okay, what the fuck is this? Okay. Okay. Research and development. Would you like to view the tutorial? Yeah, sure. There's so much on screen right now. At Mother Base, you can develop new weapons and items for use in future missions. This icon shows you that you are able to start developing weapons and items. However, to do so, you'll need the amount of GMP displayed. Okay. Be careful, if you, if you run out of GMP, development may come to a halt. More powerful weapons and items will make difficult missions that much easier. That concludes the tutorial. <laughs> okay. So I can, like, upgrade it if I had points. Is it... Okay. Yeah, no, usage usage level. Oh. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Uh, plus your sleep, numbers, stars, and it represent ranks. Uh... 
What the fuck? Okay, these are just weapons. Okay, these are weapons I have right now. What is this? It's a sniper rifle. Okay, I need to be level 7 or higher. What was the other thing smoke grenade? Level 7 or higher. Okay, interesting. Items. I'm gonna look through. What the fuck is that? Personal recovery and evacuation system. Equip and move near designated targets. Maximum of 100 people. What? I can, I guess, balloon people up? Love box. Level 29 or higher. I can upgrade that. Okay. Other. Uh. Eventual document. Okay. Grave and naked. Hello. <laughs> and fatigues. Alright, let's, let's get out of here. Um, staff. Yeah, sure. Oh, geez, there's, there's a lot, a lot going on. Mother base is divided into several teams, including the combat unit, the R&D team, and the waiting room. <laughs> waiting room. <laughs> Four by three portrait, that says. Uh, by dividing your staff between the teams and raising each team's level. Oh, there's a comma. I thought it was a period. I was like, what? <laughs> You'll be able to develop new weapons and items every time. Select auto-assign in the waiting room to automatically assign staff to teams according to their abilities. That seems like the thing I want to do most often. Recruiting talented personnel and exploiting their talents with the right assignments is the key to expanding Mother Base. This concludes the tutorial. Basically, I want to hit auto-assign every single time. Fucking dude, magpie. What the fuck? What does UNQ mean? Icon help, maybe? Victoria, no, no, it's not controls. Oh, here we go. UNQ special staff. Normal staff. Oh, it's unique. That's what UNQ is. This is like shoving down my throat right now. Moonrass? <laughs> Lungfish? Copy you? What does this even mean to me? Like where to place. Does this help me at all? I don't. Let's just. Why don't I just go to auto assign for right now? We went to auto in the waiting room to a team. Probably? <laughs> Combat unit, RD team. I have like one slot on each right now, I think. So. I probably want to put Miller somewhere since he's fucking. Like. He's Miller. Do I want to put him. What is. What is he good at? Probably like everything. Pretty much everything. He's got an. Be in building. What does that even mean? R and D. Okay, combat. He's got to be in both, so it doesn't really matter where I put him. Um, level three or level two? Well, that that's giving me pluses. It looks like so. Uh, waiting room discharge. <laughs> yeah, let me discharge Miller. Combat, yes. And then... EMP plus. So the... That's... Hmm. Who... What is this GMP numbers based on? I don't... What did, I, who, what did I, where did I, where did I assign Miller? I assigned him to combat. I need somebody with building now. R&D team. Okay. The PS3 is making violent fan noises again, so it's shit. <laughs> I thought, uh, I thought you could, like, 
sorted that out or something. Uh, this guy's got a C in building. I'm liking it. But I feel like, like, the GMP plus is good, I feel, right? But like, if I take this guy, is it worth it? I fucking have no clue how this system works. <laughs> uh, let's just put him in there. There you go. Oh, see, new new weapon. I did the good. Uh, analyzer, rank one, ready for development, development cost, uh, blah blah blah. Okay. Cabbage white. <laughs> um, rig all. So I can put like, why don't I just, why don't I just auto assign? How about that? Why don't I just auto assign? Yeah. That seems good. That's, that'll say, okay, so yeah, I, I, well, I was under the impression that I had one slot, but I have like 50 and 100, so I'm just gonna auto-assign. I'm just gonna save myself the trouble, and I'm gonna just fucking auto-assign. Alright, um, yeah, I don't want that. Uh, it's, uh, oh wait, hold on. Can I fix the thing through here? I don't even know what that means. Uh, it does not appear that I can. Button config, transit, I'll just save. I mean, I already, I already adjusted the, um, the screen on OBS, so. Mission selector. Okay, um, oh god. The uh, select mission use for L1, R1, there's the co op thing. You can become the host. Other players can. Okay. Well, we won't be doing that. Use Fulton Recovery to return. Meth soldiers only. So is that like the. MSF soldiers only? Is that like the uh, oh, snake only? So that's a one player mission. Okay, main ops. So, oh geez, what is this? Cutscenes. Oh, cool. You can look at cutscenes. <clears throat> um, do I want to do this? Snake has knocked out radio soldier in a portrait. Useful in recovery to retrieve the radio soldier. Killing the radio soldier orders it. I probably want to do this. I probably want to do this. Um, Alright. The boss has infiltrated the area around the coastal supply facility and knocked out the soldier there. But we can't just leave him there to be found. I need you to get in there and capture the unconscious soldier using the full system. This is like a tutorial system. thing, I think. Do it quickly before he comes to. I'll drive for the crunching. I, I'm drinking a frozen water bottle. <clears throat> um, use briefing files to review radio mission briefing. Uh, choose mission prep to select the weapons, items, uniforms, and other options for use during this mission. Very good guy, okay. Mission prep. Anything extra that I can do? I already have rations. Mate? Tea, popular, and yeah, I can do camera, I can do Walkman. I was just change background, I won't mess with that. Uh, I want that. Should I take this tea? I'll probably be fine. Probably won't need it. Ah, I'll take it, whatever, I got the space. Uh, anything extra I want to take here? Empty mag, no thanks, and uh, no. Oh, I can change my- whoa, <laughs> I got an RPG. Uh, sand, jungle, concrete. Oh my god, I didn't realize this was so in-depth. Ooh, red, that looks cool. I might just wear that. Oh, we got pink, too. Whoa, this has got an S in Swamp. Wow, why are there so many? Jeez. Naked red. <laughs> Yeah, this is like the best everywhere, so they want you to use that, but like, 
I'm gonna use it. <laughs> Character. Oh, you can change calig characters? Caligators. Because I fucking saw his name. Um, you can change characters. That's pretty interesting. So, I can be lobster if I want to. This is, this is interesting. I did not know this was a system. I know very little about this game. Details. So like what all right, let's 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 pick lobster. Okay, and then you get the same options. Okay, this is interesting. <clears throat> and then you you have the same equipment and everything. So this this is probably a mission that doesn't matter too much, because apparently the mission is just to send this guy up, so how do I start? There's back. MSF soldiers only, single player only. Items needed, phone recovery system. Alright, I think we're good. I think we're, uh, I think we're good. We're gonna play as this random soldier, Lobster. <laughs> and we're gonna get this mission done. <clears throat> Alright, there's the guy. Oh, it's this place again. To bring back knocked out soldiers. To use Fulton Recovery on a soldier, get up next to them so the icon appears, and push the action button. Okay. I don't, I don't know exactly where he was, honestly. I see, oh, he's over there. With some help, maybe? This place is pretty easy to stealth through. Fortunately, is he like okay. Is he not? Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, now equip this. Looks like that soldier's out cold. Try using Fulton recovery. On I got it. <laughs> Head for the recovery zone. We'll pick you up there. Do I want to like get this guy too? Why not? Right. Whee! Oh my god. Alright. That was extra ops 10. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. Heroism. Experience. S. Oh, I can just hit next. Alright. Enemies distract. I thought I extracted another one, but following words can now be infused with throw experience. What? <laughs> I have no clue what that means. Hobby magazine layout rank one. No clue what that here means. It just keeps throwing things at me, man. <laughs> uh, first snow report has arrived. All right, let's go to mother base then. I do like how this is mission based. Staff parameters have increased. Soldiers abilities has now. Oh, that's lobster. Sick. All right, okay, parameters went up due to experience in combat unit. Copy you or coip you. Coipu, whatever. How do you pronounce that? Uh, members have joined- one new member has joined unit. Um, something new. Oh, this is versus- like, I didn't want to do this. Oh, it's gonna take me to like a whole nother menu. I'm gonna have to back out of it. Yeah. Yeah. I still knew when I got trigger happy. That's my fault. Alright. Where do I want to go? Not here, not here. I want to go to staff. Smelt. <laughs> I mean, you smelt it, you dealt it, man. He's totally got a face like he just farted too, and he's like super proud of it. <laughs> anyway, I'm just gonna auto assign you, pal. I don't know, like, why you. Like. I don't see why you wouldn't auto assign somebody. It's just like. I guess you can get their. their, uh. their skills up. If you take them on combat, I guess that would be a reason. 
Well, I can, like, do stuff now, I think. I think I can do stuff. Weapons. Go all the way to the beginning. I'm just... Okay, what do we got? Development cost. Oh, it's just a silenced handgun. Sure. Oh, no, wait. It's a, wait, what? Seems pretty cheap. Okay. So this is just usage level. That's not an actual thing, wait. I'm not high enough level for this. What level am I? Oh, I'm level 6. <laughs> uh... Grenade... Stunrod... MP... Wait, did I skip one? I thought they were half. I think I'm crazy. Alright. Items. Oh, okay. There's this section, that's what I was thinking of. Over your items, what is this? GMP analyzer. Or just analyzer, I don't know why. I said GMP at the beginning. Oh, because it says that right there. Never mind. Never mind. Alright, I think we're good. Nothing I can do in there. Alright. Off to another mission. I could definitely see this game being uh, pretty, pretty cool on PSP. I already did this one. How does is there not like a thing that says what missions you did? Oh, it has little check marks next to them. Okay, I see now. So this is the only mission I have. So you can redo missions. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's do this. Snake, I rigged that radio so you can contact our young lady friend Pos. Is she okay? No need to worry. She's tougher than you think. Still just a kid. Which is exactly why she could be an effective source of information. Besides, that little Angel de la Paz is the one who gave us this mission, right? On um, the Angel of Peace, I'm assuming that means? I don't know much. I don't know any Spanish, really. Ciudad Colón. A school. The teacher told me to stay here until things quiet down. Teacher? Oh, him. He's... Yeah, that's probably good advice. See, si. he has a radio in his room, so we can talk anytime. Hmm. Pretty fancy for a teacher. Promise me, Snake, that you'll bring back peace, and... I know. I'll contact you if I find your friend. Yeah, your friend's probably dead, let's be real. Snake, if you need to know about Costa Rica, the geography, the climate, the wildlife, anything, just ask me. I know about its history and laws, too. We learned it all in school. Got it. I have a question I'll ask. I, uh... What? In school. I also learned that peace is an unnatural state for human society. Well, it's pretty true. And that war is a constant threat to our relationships with others. That's right. So, to achieve peace, we have to create it ourselves. Crying about it won't bring it about or make it last. Each one of us must go and seek it out. You won't find it without making sacrifices. No offense, but I don't know what peace is. Never felt what it's like. Huh. Never even been interested in it. Snake? Oh, sorry. Listen, Paz, I think your ideas are... admirable. And I hope they turn out to be right. Yeah, me too. Peace is in your name. Who better to help bring it back? Thanks, Nate. All about the peace. I will be here whenever you need me. Literal peace here incarnation. Snake, use your radio to call people, but stay alert. You're in the middle of a mission and can't afford to let your guard down. Got it. Need to know more about Costa Rica? Paz can help you out. Good to know. He's like my navy. Follow their transport route. This should take us straight to their main base. From what I've seen, it looks like nukes. <laughs> Agreed. The key thing now is to confirm whether those spears really are what we think they are, and if so, why they're here. Follow the transport route. Find the nukes. That's what I'm thinking. First, we should make contact with Gotta the find nukes. They can tell us more Go about into San Benista. But it looks like their hideouts already come under attack. Mm -hmm. They're up there in Costa Rica. Snake, 
infiltrate that cabin and or at least the uh, Eastern the Mon. I'm already in Costa Rica. Neutralize any guards by knocking them out, putting them to sleep, or even using the Fulton recovery system. You choose how so to essentially, the recovery system is just um the single. Uh, essentially, the recovery system is just a way to get rid of soldiers so they don't wake back up. So that way, I don't have to deal with them. Uh, like that, like I encountered in that first mission. Um, mission prep. I believe this one is snake only, if I remember right. So let me go back. Actually, it is not snake only. Delve into the swampy jungles of Eastern Make. I feel like. I rigged that radio so oh god. It plays the thing over again. So should I? Should I Alright, maybe it is snake only, because it's not letting me select anybody else. Yeah. I feel like all the main ops are snake only. Um, I'll keep that, that's fine. Anything? I don't think I have any new stuff, because I just started developing things. We'll start. Get right into this. Chapter 1, A Country Without an Army. <clears throat> in my hands. Okay, it's the anesthetic pistol. Uh, where do I... I want this... this, yeah. You can use the radio you just picked up by pressing the start button to open the menu window. You know you can assign the radio to the select button by choosing options from the menu window. Uh, I'm gonna do that. Where'd I call? Um, where does it say that at all? I'm probably blind and just don't see it, but... I've stayed normal? Stroke configs, shoe type... Nah, I want that like that. I don't, I don't see where to do that. I'd see the where to codec call, but... Select button. Oh, okay. Auto aim, switch card up skin. Yeah, I'll set that to codec call. Alright. This is Miller. Hearing you loud and clear. You know you can assign the radio. The boathouse is to the east. Head eastward. Wait, so... Head for the FSLN hideout, Snake. So now is it set to Paz? Our future... Head for the FSLN hideout, Snake. That's weird. That's weird how that functions. Do I hold it? Snake! Head for the FSLN Oh no, hideout, it's just... Snake. It's just like set to whoever is talking to me at that point in time. I know there was another guy over here. There he is. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing's going on. It's fine. Everything's fine. All right. <laughs> Let's get. I feel like I should like fault on these people. We'll keep it here at the base. How many of these do I have? I have nine. I think. Get rid of these guys. Just make sure I- yeah, okay, I have like nine. Recovering a helicopter is complete. Oh, that was the wrong thing. Whoa. Fulton recovery subject confirmed onboard helicopter. Oh, so you have to wait for that message. That's why I didn't get the guy last time. Alright. Oh, uh, there's like a thing there. EMZ, okay, so... I don't think I'm supposed to go that way. Yeah, here we go. Or, oh, is that way blocked? Is that why there's a thing there? Do I have to go around? Alright. Can I look at the map? Yeah, here we go. Blocked that way too, so I have to go to the right. <clears throat> Allegedly, I think it's blocked that way. Let me just try, just so I'll know. That yeah, not it's not part of the mission. Oh. Ration. 
Can you like get this off my screen? There you go. <clears throat> that was a very short area, actually. All right, we're almost there. There's a guy over there, don't want to let him see me. There's two guys. There's three guys. Fuck, this is not a good position. I don't have a clear shot on that guy. Uh, bam, got him. Hopefully that guy on the right doesn't see this. He saw it, he saw it, he's gonna go over to him. This is what I want. This is what I want. Got him. Alright, we're good. Let's, uh... Leave those guys, I'm not gonna... Well, I can Fulton, like, nine people. But I don't know if that's, like, a set amount or not. Let's use, let's use two more. Leave myself with a, a cool five. Alright. I think that's fine. Fulton recovering a helicopter is complete. Okay. And then I guess they just become like soldiers for me. I think that's the idea. Rio del Jade. Probably pronouncing that wrong. It's probably Hade. Should be close by. Neutralize the security detail and make contact with the Commandante. I should. There's literally dudes everywhere. Alright. Oh, I don't like this situation. I thought I was just going to be able to shoot one of them, but... How's this going to go? I see that guy up there, too. Alright, they're turning around. They're turning around. I want to get this one. Got him. I should be able to get this one, no problem. What is it? It's nothing. <laughs> Go sleep. Oh shit. Oh, it doesn't have a suppressor on it anymore. I didn't realize. Oh, that wasn't great. Um but the suppressor thing is the S right there. Oh I I guess I just have to get new suppressors. Fuck. So uh, I'm gonna go stun rod. Which I think is a one hit KO. It just like puts them out. I mean, if worse comes to worst, I could always just CQC. I don't like where that guy is. Ooh, I don't like how that guy's like looking right over here. <laughs> or else I would have just bum rushed that guy. <sighs> the one in the guard tower, anyway. Ooh. That's a good idea. I could, uh, I could try and sneak into there and, like, grab him and pull him in there, but I think I'm gonna have to do something else before that happens. Uh, alright, alright. He can still see me if I run up to him. I want him to turn around. Oh, there you go. I, I thought it was hold, but... There you go. <laughs> A little extra finesse for you. Alright. Let's get this guy now. I think he's the last one. Let's wait till he turns to go to the next area. Too slow! Enemy oh shit, by. there's another guy. They spotted you. Get out of there. I got him. You've lost him, but they're still on the hunt. Stay sharp. There's not actually anything up here. Alright, I 
think that was the last one in the area. I thought there might have been someone behind that shed. I should have checked. That's my kind of my bad. <laughs> He's all rumbling up there. That was a cutscene. There might be a quick time event though. Gotta keep my keep my finger on the thing. Freak. Guinness! The chair! No way! What do we do? Send an Easter's right. I'm looking for someone. Mi viejo! Shh! He's dead. They killed nuestro viejo. You're his daughter. Then that makes you his delegato, right? Relax, I'm not your enemy. Cuban. Hmm. Is he gar? I'll take whatever you've got. I'll take whatever you've got. I owe you one. Was that snakes? I can't hear anything in these cutscenes. Amanda. A little like El Che, no? You Cubano? Colombiano. A photographer. I came to Costa Rica to take pictures of birds. Birds? <laughs> Kessels. You've got no telephoto lens. How do you get your shots? Telephotos for amateurs. It's all in the timing. <laughs> oh, no. Let me smoke okay. too. We can talk until I finish. <laughs> Chico. Tell me what's going on here. Chico wants to smoke, man. Listen, all the cool kids are doing it. Soldiers. They don't look like private security. More like hired guns. They're loaded with the latest gear from all over the world. I heard they're a security force hired by Codessa. Uh, yeah, and I'm Papa Noel. Those guys are UCLA's. UCLA's. La Cia. I saw them setting up shop in town. They're planning to. Oh, really to wants to see where Chico's going. If that's the case. What are they after? Whatever it is, it's not us. You don't think they're here to push you back into Nicaragua? Impossible. Too much hardware. Too many bases. Didn't you see? They've got helicopters, tanks. It's like we're in Da Nang. There must be something else. Da Nang. They have a base near here. There's a factory to the north, across a suspension bridge. Factory to the north, across a bridge. Have you seen the big transport boat, mercenary crew, on the Rio del Jade? You mean the barge? It's upstream from here. Up toward Yasu. Hmm. Any idea what's on it? I could introduce you to some of our compas up there, but I don't recommend going to the mountains. We've lost a lot of people there. They take us captive. Torture us for information about our compass, and then they kill us like pigs. Got it. All right. Damn. That is a bazooka. The final refuge for El Frente after being pushed out of Nicaragua <laughs> oh, fuck. into this peaceful paradise of Costa Rica. Then El Monstruo attacked. A monster. In mi viejo. In mi viejo. My papa. Mi viejo. Papa. He was la esperanza. Our hope. Now that papa's gone, my sister's la comandante de la revolución. Do not listen to him. Papa was a hero. Oh, that's, that's like her brother. Side. Okay. I am only his daughter. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn off this fan, because it's fucking... I can't hear It takes someone great to unite all of us. Pretty cute. not just read this. Sorry to interrupt, but leaders don't choose themselves. Neither do heroes. I'll just read the comic book things. See it lies, Baranza, and they'll follow you, no question. You think so? My compass trusts me, but not one of them calls me Comandante. Amanda! <laughs> see what I mean? El Colibri! El Colibri. Oh, it's playing that song. I 
feel really obligated to shoot that red part of it. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's amazing! Like, comic book fucking aiming? That's the best. Oh my god, I get to do it again? <laughs> Please. Boom. That looks like a Metal Gear. Oh, you gotta shoot the red part. Okay. What the hell? It's a wounded nuevo, an unmanned weapon, a robot. What the hell? No, it's got Chico. He won't survive the fall. Out of my way! Better for him to die at the hand of a compa than suffer their torture. We'll get him back. Stay here. As long as I'm still alive, I might as well be safe. Over here! Ah! Find Chico! Venceremo! Find Chico. Venceremos. Interaction bonus 10 out of 10. Still got an A rank. Maybe it's because I got I, I got an alert phase. And only a soldier distracted with the fault in four. Obtain design specs for M1911. Snake, what was that thing? Whatever it was, it looked unmanned. Unmanned? I'd heard rumors, but an operational unit? What the hell is going on here? What the hell? Oh, Amanda, but the hardware they've got here isn't just unusual. It's overkill, which means one thing. It's nukes. So the question now becomes, why? We can't make that call yet. We need more intel. How? Our source is dead. But his daughter isn't. Good thinking. We can <laughs> follow her. Head for the next outpost and make contact with Amanda if she's still alive. Roger. All right. Ooh. Oh yeah. We got stuff going on. We got stuff going on. All right. Not only the tranquilizer pistol rounds take effect after a period of time. Suppressor durability has been increased through R and D. Oh. Law rank one. Yeah. There's that. Analyzer rank one. Uh. Oh. Uh -oh. Displays various information on nearby enemies, that's pretty cool. Ooh, bluegill. Four new members joined, yeah, because I fucking took them. R&D, development, okay. Just like a little overview. Alright, so let's go into research and development real quick. See if there's any extra things we can do. How do I... How do I suppressor? Do I have to, like, find suppressors? Or do I get like one permission? I guess it just auto ranks up. I don't know. Wait, mod. What's the difference between these? Is there a stat difference? I guess. Doesn't look. I don't know. I don't know. It is immediately hot in here. I might need to turn the fan back on so I don't die. <laughs> I think that needs to happen. Alright, um... Can't make anything new. Which is unfortunate, but... Development status... Analyzer. I'm not high enough level to make any of this stuff. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna need to turn that fan back on. That was a terrible decision. 
That was a terrible, awful decision. Yeah. But, yeah. Alright. I'm just gonna have to read the subtitles, I guess. Um... Fantail, Plover... I feel like these are all birds, but like, they also are like fish. I think they're all at least animals. Because <laughs> there's lobster. <laughs> Maybe it's just birds and fish. They're like birds and sea creatures. Uh, ready for development. Oh. Because I assign people? Sick. Now, now I can build shit. I probably should go to the staff first every time. <laughs> I'm getting that kind of vibe. Um, yeah, I wanna, I wanna build this. Wait, what? Oh, I hit no. I'm an idiot. Uh, bam. 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 Just start building everything. Oh, that's already in. Already in progress. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Oh, did I do everything? Yeah, I did everything. All right. Items. I didn't do items. Every items. Ration. Laser. Well, I have like a hundred of these. I just can't. Um, it can only carry like seven. <laughs> Analyzer. So I can pretty much use them. Whenever I want. So that's good to know. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. Do I have any side ops? So I can play as a random and do random nonsense. Ooh, I have quite a few. I have two. Oh surge, cutscenes, regions. Okay. Um let's do oh target practice at Mother Base's shooting range. You have unlimited ammo. Might as well do this, he seems like pretty free. Target practice. As a special treat, you can practice freely on any of the targets in the shooting range today. Shoot away. When you're done, head over to the exit. I feel like this is just like a free thing. <laughs> Does it give anybody XP though? Who do I want to level up? Who's like really shit? Oh, this guy's pretty shit. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's pretty shit. This, these two are both pretty shit. Let's do this one, though. Seems like he needs it. <laughs> uh, it doesn't even, doesn't even really matter. It's just target practice. <laughs> I'm just assuming it'll level him up. So. Gotta get in on that. I wonder if the longer I train, the uh... Commence target practice. Bam. 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 From downtown. Oh. Shit. That was bad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I wasn't supposed to shoot him. I thought it was just like he's blocking. Blocking. Nailed it. Oh, come on. Yeah. Yeah, I got him. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. There's a hostage down there. Eh. Alright. Nailing it. I'm doing it. Oh, jeez. I'm doing it. I'm really doing it. I'd really be just using this. Let's, let's get some, some machine gun action going on.
Okay. And I am bodying everybody. Except for that guy. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna shot that hostage. Alright, I think I'm good. I think I'm done. Um. I'm just. <laughs> Alright. How do I actually just leave? Do I just walk out? Oh, there, yeah, there's the exit. What the fuck is all this? You can like walk up the stairs? Hmm. Man, I am just getting really tired. I have only been streaming for like an hour and a half. Whew. I might unfortunately have to cut the t today's stream a little short. Did I even help him at all? Hey, mission selector. I don't believe it helped him. I don't know. I, there was like a little beep, but I don't know if that was just like a segue or whatever to the uh, to the stat screen. Uh, score attack. Oh, now this is more what I want. Target practice commencing now. Shoot all the targets in the shooting. Yeah, I'll just skip that. I know he's pretty much going to say the same thing. Uh, Moonrass. <laughs> Since he's still uh, just absolute trash, I might as well use him. Because I think this will actually count more. Uh, and since we're just doing target practice, I'm going to make him wear the coolest thing ever. Uh, I wanted him to be shirtless, but clearly that was that's not happening, so we're just gonna do red. Make him look like a badass. Boom, start mission. Alright, now there's a point counter now. I feel like I should... I think I should use the M16. Boom. 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 That was bad. Boom. 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 I'm gonna reload. Boom. I got this. I'm doing it. I am the marksman master, Moonrass. Moonrassy, however you pronounce that. It's got a stupid name. Or it's a code name anyway. But it's dumb. <laughs> the lobster guy though, that guy's got it going on. I'd love to be codenamed lobster. Be like, yeah, I'm lobster, I'm about to give you the clamps. <laughs> I guess people could just make the pun that they're gonna boil you though. That'd be that'd be not great. <clears throat> Looks like that lobster's just been boiled. Eh? That'd probably that'd probably screw you up a little bit. Okay. And I am not getting these headshots at long range. There we go. I'm not looking at my point total either, because I'm just kind of like focusing on shooting them. Oh man. Oh no. We're going down pretty fast now. I gotta, gotta snap more. Gotta combine speed and accuracy. I gotta be the best that I can be. Oh damn. It was just a little bit too late. 
Where's the timer at? Oh my god, I still have like a minute left. It's so long. I think I'm only doing this once. Does my clip like auto reload or something? Feels like it's really big. But I still had like a lot of clip left, I don't know why I did that. Gotta get these long-range headshots. I don't think I've hit any civilians though. Well, that's good. That it? Oh god. Yeah. 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 Seven seconds. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm doing it now. Oh, get that guy. Get that guy. Oh. Alright. What did I get? 22,500? Probably could have done better. Probably could have done a lot better. Feels like my eyes are kind of slowly melting though, so... It's definitely a factor. Well, I still got an S rank. So I'll take it. That was more of an endurance test than anything. Oh man, I can't believe I've only been streaming for an hour, my eyes, I might have to like, <laughs> be an idiot and ruin my sleep schedule or something, just to stream. That would be an awful, awful decision, but... <sighs> yeah, I think unfortunately I'm gonna have to stop early, I'm still pretty burned out from last night's stream, but at least we got to, uh, we got to start the game. That's, and I'm, I'm I've got a feel for it now, so... That's that's all we really needed. Um, so unfortunately, I'm gonna stop. Thanks for watching, everybody.